Patrick, he's got an unbuckle. Oh, he's got to get the glasses on first. That's very important. He's got the cue to come do what he wants to do this afternoon, and that is celebrate. And you look right back at that bunch. Yep, there it is. about a team effort from start to finish and that last pit stop obviously the clincher oh my goodness uh darlington all over again right so i guess uh racing guys don't want us leaving too much they got to make it uh, make it difficult on us but what can i say about uh about everybody uh furniture racing uh toyota trd uh bass pro shops denver mattress furniture row i mean just everybody that makes this possible uh texture on our friends there sprint the fans fans have given us a ton of support not only over the years but the last two and uh, it's definitely helped us so just uh man this feels good it's uh describe the relief you're done with round one <laughs> well we got more races to win and we can win some so just uh what can i say i mean uh so many people to thank and so many people that are responsible for this and uh, i'm a lucky guy to get to drive this black 78 and um colburn and jazzy everybody on this team the pit crew you know, Barney for giving us everything we need. Uh, but I think TRD engines were incredible again. Uh, Andy Graves, all those guys are doing a doing a heck of a job. Everybody, JGR building chassis and uh, having competition meetings with us, and all that good stuff, and helping us out. It's been uh, an awesome relationship. So, what can I say, man? It's uh, this is where we want to start it off, and uh, feels feels awesome. Mark, what were you thinking early on when you had to come to pit road for that tire going down? Don't give up, just keep digging. And uh, this is long, there was a long way to go at that point. You know, and uh, I was like, you know, on one hand, it was like, oh, here's the bad luck's gonna bite us again. And on the other, it was like, we got a lot of time to make it up. So we're lucky it happened early. And uh, we were able to have an awesome race car all day and just keep working on it. We, uh, in the middle of the race, we weren't that good. And we got back in traffic and we struggled a bit. And Harvick ran into us and Bender Fender, I think on purpose, and uh, had to come back from that. So all in all, it was uh, just, a, just an unbelievable day. and. Uh, Total team effort. That's what it's going to take to win a championship. And uh, you kick off the uh, uh, the, the uh, work toward childhood ovarian cancer month, September, with a win here in Victory Lane. We know those steering wheels are going to get auctioned off in October. What does it mean to you two to start it this way? Well, it's just uh, it's unbelievable. I'm uh, just really proud of Sherry for what she's done, and you know, just uh, happy to be a part of it. I got to thank all the guys that brought their steering wheels out again this weekend. I think there was 15 guys out there today. Um, with their steering wheels and uh, you know we got ours and Johnny Morris already said he wanted to buy the one from Darlington and uh, I think it's the same one so it's got two wins on it now with Buddy and uh, it's just amazing to uh, to see what Sherry's been through and what she's doing and how hard she's working to help others it's really neat to be part of that overcoming a big theme both on the racetrack and in his personal life Martin Truex wins today at Chicagoland